There is a big win that has been recorded in history of Biafra as we continue to march forward and keep reaching the Biafran restoration. Listen and listen attentively. The zoo is facing what is bigger than them and they don't know because they want to keep imitating the whole process. Our victory has been recorded in different styles. Now listen and listen attentively. The German has now pre-welcomed the, 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 the big beds which are Biafrans to continue the path that which they have all based their thoughts on see we must realize the gimmick that this people wants to play but at the same time when realizing this fact we must put ourselves together and hold ourselves together to continue in the path that which we have been and that part is the Biafra actualization so let's continue to imitate one of the biggest gospel of truth and the german force has now rebranded and our whole means understand we have now come to realize one of the biggest effects of what it should be and by so doing everything will be made to commencement on the biggest struggles the German machine has continued to put ourselves in a whole roller coaster and that is what we are engaging ourselves to which makes more sense to us which must continue to write our stories in a very big format the meeting that they are going to be having with four Biafran powerful force Prime Minister Simon ever inclusive with other top German generals is going to yield a lot of good news and good benefits if we continue in that path. We must tell ourselves this very truth that for long we have been put down, for long we have been taken for granted, for long they have tried to, you know, put us aside. But one of the biggest gospels of all time is that Pierre France are not ready to give up. That's just the good news. Mm -hmm. That's the good news. Why should we give up when we know that giving up is, is, is not in our identity? Giving up is not part of us. So the more they try to make us feel low of ourselves, the more we tell them that, see, we are Pierre France. And I, we cannot give up on this. I am Uncle C. I I give up. Our children will laugh at all. So let our children wake up and see that their fathers are fighting the fight for their freedom. And they will join the fight. That's how we join the fight that our fathers fought. And today, our friends are excelling everywhere because we fought a battle of what we cannot watch ourselves being killed on daily basis. And that is what Ojuku told them. The way you ended Pierre France, the same way you watch your people ended for no just reason. It can't happen in Pierre France land. So if you are hearing anything, just know that it's the politicians that are ganking them up. But we are watching and we are hopeful. So I'm speaking to you people now. There's a big wahala in the zoo. As United Nations discovers the second part of the DNA. Speaks from the zoologic. <laughs> Onyenu, Yogowane. 16 DNA was discovered before and today 24 has been discovered. I told you, whether they like it or not, Biafra will be free this year. Definitely free. Only, only, only if actually email, they cannot do anything. They don't know, they don't have anything to do because we are running faster than their shadows. 
let me again say what I know how to say and let the true identity be revealed. There is a massive game that must be put in place to make sure that Biafra is achieved at all costs. And by so doing, everybody will get to see where we have been pulling out. And that's the joy of what we do. They have discovered 24 today, and 24 plus 16 is how many? If who is good at maths, that's 40. 40. We can no longer allow ourselves to be put pre-orderly. Did you hear what I said? <clears throat> pre-orderly. We cannot allow ourselves to be looked down on. Knowing fully well that what we teach is nothing but the gospel. They have tried to reconvince us. They have tried to push us aside. They have even tried to, you know, do loss of gains and loss. But we are well focused and putting more practice in what should be done. And I must say it that Biafra naturalization is a game that must be changed. It takes more time, it takes big time, and it takes uh, a very, very aggressive time. And that is where we must be very careful. At all costs. So let's be guided. Let's push ahead. The victory that we will pursue has now been made open <coughs> and reopened. He says, he's not crying. They're not wondering why did these people do this? Where did these people get this kind of power? How did they get this kind of power? They are just wondering. They're just like, what is happening? Will you answer? Will you answer the question? Or I think it's just more like a fairy tales or a gist that is not complete. You should be careful out there. Our word is very simple. Give us Biafra. And by so doing, we will definitely see how to achieve these whole big dreams. <clears throat> this whole energy. And these peculiar words. Where everybody must see what must be done. So, along the line, as we push through engaging ourselves in a proper order, let's go and understand one thing. That we're not going to be slaves. See, I am saying it in my full chest that Biafra is going to come. In my full chest. Yes, I don't know when, but it's going to happen. What I'm sure is that it's going to happen in our generation. In case I call prayer for Nigeria in distress, I hope we find a call. If I call, I call prayer for Nigeria in distress. If I need to get that when is Biafra coming? It is going to come in our generation because sooner or later they are going to get tired of this. If the white people could leave Biafra, sorry, could leave Africa, why wouldn't Biafra come? Think about it. <laughs>